Hi guys, this is Brandon Wilmarth with More Public Schools and you're watching Tech in the Classroom. You're going to figure out how to add a specific calendar to your favorites today. So maybe you're part of Southmore, Westmore, or any other school that has district level calendars in the public folders. I'm going to show you how to find that in Outlook 2013. Uh, we used to be able to just kind of scroll down and see public folders. Well, that's not there anymore. So what we're going to have to do is we're going to actually have to go to folders. Now most of you might not be seeing this because you've never accessed it so click on the three dots and then you're going to see notes and folders and shortcuts. So as soon as you go to folders under all public folders expand that. Now find your calendar whether you're part of Brink or Central Junior High or Highland East or any one of the schools listed here on the top level or like Southmore or Westmore where you have to open it up and find more calendars. Go ahead and find the one that you want. So I'm a former English teacher so I want to look at the English lab. Now all of us, since these are public folders, all of us can look at these if we have rights to actually see. So here we are, we see that this is the Westmore English lab. Now I don't have rights as a teacher to just simply click and edit this. Most of us just have view rights and so we need to email our department chair to actually add our reservation. Uh, but if you don't want to go this route to get to it every time, the easiest way is to go ahead and right click on it and then add to favorites. It's as simple as that. Uh, you're going to get a little add to favorites box that looks like this and you just hit add. Now, when you add that, that means that it's going to show up in your actual calendar tab under other calendars. So now I have my instructional technology and I have my Westmore English lab. Okay, so one of the coolest things about this is that this is my personal calendar right here. And this is the other calendar that I just favorited. Now I can actually look at both of these at the same time and make sure that I don't have any conflicts. If I wanted to actually take this and then drag it over to my personal calendar, that's all I got to do. And now all of those reservations are on my personal calendar and will show up, depending on how I have it viewed in here, on my upcoming calendar tasks. So I uh, hope this helps. And if you ever have any questions, email me at brandonwilmarth at moreschools.com. And as always, check out the other instructional videos on our Tech in the Classroom YouTube channel. And have a wonderful day.